stands for data loss prevention. And you might be thinking that that's just something the IT department should be worrying about, but it's not. Everyone needs to be focused on DLP. In this episode, we're going to teach you how to avoid phishing scams. Now, a phishing scam is when a scammer uses an email to trick you into giving them your personal information. But how can I avoid phishing scams? It's hard because the emails appear to come from PayPal, an online streaming service, or a social media account. It usually says that because of some change in the system, the users need to re-enter their usernames and passwords to confirm. It may even tell you that your account is suspended, which often makes people panic. The emails usually have a link to a page that looks like that of the real company. Look carefully at any email that says something to do something like that. That's right, never click on a link that you receive in an email. Even if you think the email is legitimate from an account you have, simply go to your web browser and visit your account's website directly. Log in from there and check to see if there are any issues with your account. If the email seems to be from a person you know asking for personal information, gift cards or your password, anything suspicious, call that person to confirm the message. And remember, nobody accepts payments and gift cards. That's right. So if an account or person is asking you to purchase a bunch of gift cards, that's a huge red flag. I hope you learned a little bit about phishing scams. Stay safe!